What is going on guys, welcome to another Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare video and we've been hit with some massive news. Now I am back to making my regular videos hopefully very soon, I am back to playing my Xbox so I can make videos for you guys as well. I will also be getting a new PC very soon as well so you're going to see more videos, you're going to see higher quality videos and also longer videos so make sure you look out for that as well. But today we got some massive news from Plants vs Zombies themselves on Twitter and it is basically talking about Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare. Now they did say that Legends of the Lawn was a final major content update for Garden Warfare. The team is now focused on the future, stay tuned. So what does this mean? This means that there is going to be no more major content or major DLC for Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare, but they said major DLC. This consists of maps and characters, but they could still add some DLC like customizations or possibly some new spawnable zombies or special waves in Garden so there could still be more DLC added to the game, but the content what takes the longest time to make, which is maybe new game modes, maps and characters, there is going to be no more DLC like that in Garden Warfare. Now you might be thinking, oh damn it, no more DLC for Garden Warfare, but you have to think about it another way, if they are not focusing on DLC like that, what are they going to be focusing on? And I think this, there's no confirmation or anything like that, but I personally think, and a lot of people also think, they are working on a second game plan vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 which they could have been working on for quite some time now and I'm going to show you a few reasons why I believe this but I just want to say that Gary did ask quite a while ago on Twitter if they did make a second game what would they like to see like what would we like to see and we said a lot of things like we'd need we want more characters we'd like maybe a theatre mode you know like you got on Call of Duty Black Ops 2 where you could like fly around and maybe make cinematics and stuff we'd like a removable hood and also a lot of people wanted like Garden Ops but for the zombies team so either the zombies are capturing the garden or they are defending from the plants there are lots of things that we did want and he did tweet that out a while ago so they was definitely thinking about it what i'm going to do now is show you a few clips from streams that they could just be a slip of the tongue or anything and it could mean absolutely nothing like i said nothing's been confirmed but i'm just going to play you a few clips of where they've kind of maybe made a little mistake or something so just watch the clips and you will understand why a single player campaign mode um, and you know what I guess what the team thinks about that you know is, is that something that we've thought about in the past um, is there a reason you know that we avoided it in, in uh, Garden Warfare? Uh, Garden Warfare 1 was uh, designed to be a multiplayer game from the ground up we wanted to do multiplayer and we wanted to do it right this is one of the most rare items that anyone can get within Garden Warfare also the art on this is, is I don't actually think it's seen anywhere outside of PopCap it's uh, concept art for Garden Warfare 2 that we did in this building, so even that is rare. So as you can see from the first clip, Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare was referred as Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 1, and why would you refer it to 1 if there is only one Garden Warfare anyway? But a lot of debate is going on whether he's saying Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare, and then he's saying 1 because he's talking about a topic and then goes on to say 2 for another topic. So that is one thing uh, that was picked up on, but like I said, no confirmation whatsoever, but you wouldn't refer it to Garden Warfare 1 if there was only one game. And the second clip you did see, Jeremy did actually say the concept art for Garden Warfare 2, but like I said, this could just be a slip up and he, he didn't mean to say it, it was actually concept art for Garden Warfare, uh, because if you do look at it, it does just look like the scientist that is the, in the game now, with the, uh, the marine biologist with the dolphin blaster, um, so it does look like concept art for Garden Warfare that we play right now, so it could just be a slip of the tongue of saying 2, but nevertheless, we do not know if they are working on a second game, I personally think they are, but of course they cannot say anything at all. But one thing I do just want to say before I end this video is that Gary said you want to go to the next few streams, which is going to be Friday the 20th of March and also Friday the 27th of March. He said there may be some interesting things on the 20th, but there is going to be a lot more interesting things on the 27th, so uh, there are definitely some streams you want to come out to. Who knows what they're going to be showing, it could be nothing major special, it could just be maybe some tiny little bits of DLC for Garden Warfare, or it could be something completely different, we do not know, but I did just want to make this video to update you guys on what is happening, so no more major DLC for Garden Warfare, but that does not mean no DLC whatsoever at all, we could get some spawnables, we could get some new waves in Garden Ops, and we could also get some new customizations. definitely looking now forward to the future to see what Plants vs Zombies can do for us, they're working on this game every single day, 
day and as plants vs zombies did say stay tuned so definitely keep the lookout on twitter but hopefully you did enjoy this video leave your comments down below of what you think about this are you happy with them working on something else and stopping or slowing down the process of dlc or do you just want them to carry on working on dlc for this game leave your comments down below i hope you did enjoy this video it is good to be back my name is zero Exfusions, and i'll catch you guys next time